Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to Connie's Cooking Channel. So glad you decided to join me another day. We are going to make some cod. We're going to fry it in our frying pan. And as you know, we only need a few ingredients. So I have some salt and pepper in this container right here. Okay. And then we're going to use Louisiana crispy fish fry as our seasoning mix. So let me go ahead and season the fish. And of course, you can season your fish however you like. You want, Some people use onion powder. Some people use garlic powder. It's really up to you. Let me go ahead and get the salt and pepper on it. And then we're going to go ahead and mix it in a plastic bag. Our breading with our fish. And then we'll come right back to you. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. I have the fish now seasoned. What you want to do is wash your fish first. Make sure you dry it very well with a paper towel so that your breading will be able to stick on the fish. Then you want to lay it on a plate and let the seasoning for a few minutes sink into your fish before you actually put it into your frying pan. Now I have the frying pan on number four on my stove and it's been heating up for a few minutes now. So we are ready to place our fish into our frying pan. Let's get this party started. Now, if you ever want to sample to see if your grease is hot, let's put some of that breading in there. If it starts doing that, then we know it's ready. So let's place our fish in there. And it doesn't take long to cook this fish. A few minutes. Our grease is very hot. So I'm going to pan fry this for you. When it is done, I'm going to come back and show you our finished product. So our fish is almost done. And a good way to determine if your fish is cooked is when it's actually stopped cooking in your grease. So when you first place it in there, the grease is like hot and it's steaming. So you just want your fish to be golden brown. You make sure you have a paper plate. Make sure you have a napkin to put your fish on. To soak up the grease. I'm going to turn that one. Doesn't that look delicious? I love the seasonings on here. And we have one more piece to put in there. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is our last piece of fish coming out of here. Now, I do have the other pieces of fish sitting on a plate. A paper towel to soak up the grease. Now, one way you can figure out if your fish is done, if it's to stop cooking. You're looking for that nice golden brown. Does that not look good? Look at that piece of fish. Yum, yum. <laughs> okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is our finished product of our codfish. I'm gonna let you sample it first. Yum, yum. Yeah, I know I like me some hot sauce, right? So here I have my hot sauce with my tartar sauce. Gonna dip that in there as such. Why don't y'all leave a comment below? Let me know what kind of breading you use for your fish. Mm. Leave a comment below and let me know what breading you normally use for your fish. I kind of like Louisiana, but there's a couple other ones that I actually try as well. This is good, y'all. Quick, easy, and very healthy. <laughs> One other bite. 
I'd like to thank you for watching. Don't forget to like the video, share the video with your friends and family, leave your comments below. Let me know what you think about this recipe. Don't forget to let me know also what type of breading you use. And hit the subscribe button at the very top left hand corner where you see my photo and the bell next to it so you'll be notified on my next upload. So until then, God bless and have a wonderful day.